you are breathing in air okay <laughs> you can't wait just because you are breathing in air i'm kidding Michiamo, my son is Ajaj and watching my hero greetings and welcome to Healthy Weight Ajaj. What is natural weight? So natural weight is a weight that a person maintains normally with spontaneous attitude towards body, food, and movement. Okay, so in a short explanation, that is the healthy weight and the healthy weight helps you to achieve determined comfort and protects you from health risk so then does that mean that there are other ways of measuring weight yes of course there are a few types and today i'm going to share with you the four common um, ones we have the ideal weight then the ideal weight is normally the weight that is being measured um, with the weight of a person or the mass of a person and the height okay so the start stature of a person this is the body mass index the BMI so with the BMI um, you are able to know whether you are underweight whether you are on your normal weight if you are overweight if you are obese with all the types obesity first category second category and third category and so forth then we have the desirable weight the desirable weight is when one goes to see a practitioner or during consultation the practitioner imagines the weight according to what you do so if you are a runner um, there is this um, imaginary imaginary figure that you, that you are supposed to gain if you are a person that works a nine to five job, setting a sedentary lifestyle, then there is this um, imaginary weight or size that you are being categorized into. Then we have the desirable weight, and this I see as a fairy tale. That is when um, we want to be like a particular figure, like we want to gain a particular something. You are desiring to get that. I wanted to have this beautiful figure tall slim with a little bit of hips those time the breast and the butt wasn't really like taken seriously okay so now people are looking forward for our glass shape okay that is something that someone also desired as a teenager i got to that point that stage that i also wanted to have those things so normally it is what one wants okay but sometimes it is impossible to, to, to get sometimes it is but that would mean that changing your lifestyle your diet exercising and even going through surgeries and we have the natural weight or the healthy weight okay that is what I talked about that is when one achieve or manifest determined comfort okay and it protects you from health risk that is what we all want we want something that is going to take us to a peaceful state of mind where we are going to, our body is going to function properly there are many factors that um, comes in place when we talk about natural weight genetics is number one because you didn't just come out of a thing and even the scriptures the bible tells us that god created mankind in his own image you came about because your mom and your dad brought you okay so these people the genes of these people made you if your father is tall and your mom is tall there's a possibility that you are going to be tall if your mom is short your dad is tall there is a possibility of you being short or you being tall Okay, if you have both parents short, definitely are going to be short. You might be tall, and that is one out of hundred cases that is possible. If I am um, an obese person, okay, over obese, not overweight, obese, and I give birth, there is a possibility that my child is going to be obese. There is a possibility because once you give birth. Um, 
the adipose tissue or the adipose cells are already found in your genes okay so you make the child out of that okay so genetics is the number one factor that we look into when we we are talking about the natural weight hormones is also a factor you are a human being you are made up of organs you are made up of that you are made up of things that produces hormones so your hormones also determines how you are going to be if there is hormonal imbalance that causes bloating of the belly or bloating of the stomach any factor that makes that brings up a person okay genetics hormone and metabolism the metabolism being the third um, factor that comes in place when we talk about the natural uh, weight one can have a high metabolic rate okay for example you can eat anything that you want and you will never gain weight there are people like that unlike we that even even if we are breathing in air okay <laughs> you gain weight just because you are breathing in it i'm kidding but anyway um metabolic rate also is an important role that plays in your natural weight there are other factors um familiar situations um let's say marriage separation divorce child birth um sickness okay health this situation also um, are factors that affect one's natural weight social um, environment that is the people you associate yourself with place you find yourself if i find myself in a village where everything is 100 percent organic um, if there are less processed products okay i'm going to eat healthy and that can also affect my natural weight seasons seasons it can be dry season it can be wet season rainy season it can be winter summer autumn spring as we all know we find it difficult to lose weight during winter during the cold seasons because um, i don't like running i don't like running so during summertime i can go out and jog in the warm or the hot um, season and i'm okay but please don't ask me to go and jog or run or do physical exercise in the cold i'm going to freeze to death the political the social economic culture the media what we see on the television what we hear people around us the television is telling you to drink milk every morning taking breakfast every morning because it is important that is what you are going to do but it is not for everybody it is not good for everybody to eat in the morning okay there are people who find it difficult to digest some food and so this also affects us political decisions made by a country affect um, affect your natural weight so if you go to the stores things that are imported are being um, allowed by the minister of agriculture or the interior or the exterior affair transportation and all those stuff in europe there are categories of things that you are going to find in the shops okay the same thing applies to ghana there are things that are here that you aren't going to find in the Ghanaian local shops or in the supermarket so uh, the national or the political choices made also affect your natural weight and lastly i'm going to say lifestyle if you are a sedentary person if you are someone who works a, a strenuous or a tedious um, job if you are active if you are um, a professional um, footballer or a sports person it is going to affect you the people that you go work um, if you have a group of people that go out every saturday or friday evening drinking party and all these things it will affect you if you are a chef and you find yourself making lovely recipes cooking trying out new stuff okay it is going to affect it and if you are someone who doesn't like to eat that also has an effect okay on your natural weight all right so now let's take a quick look at how to unblock your natural weight so before you can unblock to know your natural weight you have to take 
all of these factors or this set point into consideration whether you are in a new marriage and the honeymoon phase whether you are happy you are sad whether your work is tedious or not take into consideration all these things your lifestyle where you are genetics hormone metabolism familiar situations and all these stuff you can be overweight okay with the ideal weight that is the basic mass index and be in your natural weight or your healthy weight you can be underweight in the bmi factor and be in your natural weight in the healthy sector okay healthy weight one thing that you have to put behind your mind or in your mind is that you aren't going to have the same weight or the same shape from let's say your teenage to your um, old age it changes season comes season goes so there is going to be this fluctuation there is going to be this increase decrease and that is okay because it depends on a lot of factors the number one um, weight on block your natural weight is accepting yourself as you are will help you make some steps make some decisions okay to help you look inside the mirror accept that you are the way you look be grateful that you are alive then if you want to make changes look yourself into the mirror and ask yourself what changes do you want to make is this a real goal is this something attainable are you going to hurt yourself doing that get rid of some friends get rid of some food get rid of some lifestyle the second step is mindful nutrition being mindful i'm going to talk about this in another video i'm going to take it step by step and explain these things to you mindful nutrition that is when you know what you're eating you know what you're putting into you you know what you're putting on your body what you're wearing you are mindful the effects that it has on you the negative and the positive when to eat when not to eat when to detox when not to detox when to fast when not to fast when to take care of yourself okay joyful movement or mindful movement so not everybody enjoys going to the gym and lifting weights okay muscles helps in burning calories and lean um, mass is very important as a human being but you have to know the type of movements to do if you enjoy dancing then take that as a form of movement that will help you to maintain that natural weight or to unblock that natural weight if you like to jog if you like to skip if you like to build your body go to the gym taking into consideration doing it joyfully with no stress with no um without injuring yourself because too much of everything is bad i'm not saying that don't exercise but find what works for you for your body so that you can do it joyfully do you need to get help if you need help i am here for you we are here for you health coaches dietitians your physician friends family start a conversation with someone it is someone that you know that is going to help you attain that if you have realistic goals it will help you in table sample thanks so much for being here with me and listening to me thank you for being a part of the family if you want to know more don't forget to send me a message or leave something in the comment box below. Impey, have a day. That's it. Bye bye.